a special time of year brings special concerns. We visited Stafford PD to get the lowdown on what to watch out for this holiday season. Crimes that are prevalent during the holiday seasons are DWIs, domestic violence, theft, and burglaries. Alcohol is often part of the holiday celebration with families and friends and co-workers, which is why DWI arrests and fatal drunk driving accidents occur. Police are patrolling the streets in an attempt to keep the roadway safe for you and I. If you plan on drinking at holiday events, avoid driving home and either take an Uber, Lyft, or find a place to stay for the night. Many people spend more time with family during the holidays compared to other months throughout the year. Tension can run high and unresolved issues can surface, resulting in arguments and even physical altercation. If you're struggling with a domestic issue during the holidays, discuss it with a professional to prevent the problems from becoming a bigger one. Malls and shops throughout the country will be busy and overcrowded with holiday shoppers. Shoplifters may attempt to take advantage of overwhelmed staff. Although many Americans now do their shopping online, they also must watch out for porch pirates who steal unwanted packages soon after delivery. Lastly, burglary is another common theft crime that occurs during the holiday, since many families take vacation or road trips, leaving the house empty for days or weeks. If you are a witness to any crime, try to get a description of the suspect. If they flee in a vehicle, try to get the color, make, model, or even the license plate. Always be aware of your surroundings and always let someone know your whereabouts. Next, we visited the Stafford Fire Department for some more safety tips. Today we're just gonna talk about a little bit of fire prevention. Uh, let's start with candles. I know everybody loves the house to smell great. Uh, let's just kind of take the standard precautions of making sure that we blow out those candles before night. Uh, whenever we do light those candles, just make sure that we put the uh, matches and lighters away where kids can't find them. Also, with Christmas trees, it's a great time of year. Everybody has Christmas trees. Whenever we're uh, plugging up those Christmas trees, just make sure that we take the precautions of maybe plugging them into a surge protector to prevent any type of uh, overload on the plugs and cords and things like that. Also, those Christmas trees, if we are buying real Christmas trees, just make sure that uh, they are getting watered daily Almost one third of homes catch on fire every year due to Christmas trees and overloading plugs. Um, uh, heat sources close to Christmas trees like decorations and curtains uh, maybe should be left three feet away from Christmas trees. For space heaters, uh, one recommendation would, to be, would be to keep them at least three feet away from bed covers and curtains and any type of flammable object, something that can catch. Uh, restroom items and toiletries and things like that. The smoke detectors, it's, it's the time now where the weather's changing. We also, we highly recommend uh, every, every year you change your smoke detectors out at least twice a year. Uh, change the clock, change your batteries in the smoke detector. If they're hardwired, just make sure we get an, elect an electrician to come out and take a look at it and make sure that it's wired properly. If we're gonna be hanging Christmas lights and uh, having Christmas trees, uh, at least have a small fire extinguisher. You can go to your local uh, hardware store, Home Depot or Lowe's, and you can purchase a fire extinguisher from there. The Stafford Police Department is open 24 hours a day, and we're here to help. Happy holidays. For Stafford Weekly News, this is Randall Williams.